they were hiding, as you can see in the box, they are quite hidden. Not hidden, though, not, but that I like. Um, this comes with four minifigures. This has 717 pieces, I think. Comes with four minifigures, the X Wing itself, and a little maintenance car. Oh, and a little cargo as well. And the ladder. Um, the X Wing itself is really good. Uh, but we'll show you the X Wing first before the minifigure. Uh, yeah, the X Wing first, and then the minifigures, and then all the stuff, and then why. Well, no, 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 why? Took up the spring loaded. You have spares, though. You have a couple of spares. You have two spare spring loaded sh shooters there. And the instruction manuals right here. The big manual. And then the back. And then. Yeah, yeah, just to say, 717 pieces is in the back. It says what type of x ring it is and the length of it. And then what you can do with the website, where it was on the website. All the other sets, which I haven't got. This is first out of the sets of Force Winter I got in. All the minifigures there. All the features that has, and then the parts list that you can get if you don't want to buy the set at retail price which is at 79.99 i think but i got this one for 65 on ebay so it was a little bit 10 10 out less than retail price what you get this for when it came out um here's a box just shows you the picture of the falcon the minifigures there it's set number 75102 age 814 and uh, the top of the box shows you all the figures the side of the box shows you the picture in the lug club uh, nothing at the bottom and the side of the box shows you all the features, weapons and the blueprints of it because in this one on the side showing off the blueprints of the models and so here we go with the X-Wing now. So the X-Wing is a beautiful model. I love this model so much. I'm actually quite intrigued to get in it the new one that's going to be coming out later this year in the summer of 2018, which is the, the original trilogy X-Wing. And of course you can open up the X-Wing by this. This is a new version of it they can do. And the last model, with the original trilogy one, it was able to open up by doing that, but this time it's covered up by an engine, so it's now on the top. Um, the engine's in um, pinky purple. Um, it's got a new design of the front, like here, like where the S foils come up. The landing, the landing bit. Stug shooters there, a new cockpit piece, I'll try and take it out perfectly. New cockpit piece, we like it. They could be using that for the new original trilogy one. So that is the X-Men, very like it. Um, and it, in later that year, they did release the blue and grey one. I didn't want to get the blue and grey one because it didn't have any of the good minifigures that I liked. As in here, that... I wanted so I didn't want the Laura said Tekka and the Flame Trooper. Um, it would be nice if I got in the Paul Dameron in his leather jacket suit and then BB 8 as well. I've got another BB 8, but I've got another BB 8 in this set as well. So, so that is the fight itself. Um, here are the minifigures. So, first up on the right um you've got Paul Dameron in his flight suit and he has grey no black helmet with the well this is one of the newer style of helmets they start using these in the Force Awakens he's got a pistol right here and he does have a double sided face which shows up 
and looking all angry, I guess. Because it's an angry face of Oscar Isaac from that's the actor who plays um, Paul Dameron. He's got BB-8, just regular BB-8. And then got Resistance Pilot. No double sided, no double sided head for this one. He basically the same, but instead of his helmet, it's like white now. And then you get the Resistance Ground Crew, which, um, which he operates the maintenance cart, which I'll show you later. Oh no, actually. So the maintenance cart here, um, it's a very good build actually. I kind of like this. Um, this is actually the second towards the X-Wing itself. The X-Wing itself is pretty much amazing. Um, you can put the resistance ground crew in here. And you can probably fit someone on here. So, you can just take the pilot here. And the resistance pilot. Oh, I'll just stand them up. Stand up. That's how, you, that's how they did it in the original trilogy with the... So there you go, that's what it look like, the resistance ground crew, the resistance ground, ground crew, um, pilot, resistance pilot standing up, I'll do that because that's what they did in the original trilogy, and then you get a little cargo with the spanner and then more ammo for the stud shooters. Um, <coughs> And you've got the ladder right here. You just put the ladder right there. Just so that probably will be on to the X-Men. And um, they have modified the R2 units where you put your R2 unit in. And um, to fit BB-8, which he is a ball. So literally they put in the, the one studge. The one studge you can sit on there. And um, you can fit... Paul and his weapon in the cockpit. Like so. And then you put Paul in. It's just a seat, regular grey seat in. And there you go, you get Paul and BB 8 in the X Wing. In the X Wing now. Um, so yeah, um, if you enjoyed this video, there's going to be a whole video out either today or tomorrow depending if both packages come at the same time if they don't it'll be out tomorrow um, and a review probably later that day as well uh, as well and probably uh probably on monday will be monday because I don't, I don't record at the weekends that's what i'm going to do now i'm going to record at the week don't record at the weekends I'll be really busy. I'm really busy at the weekend, so it will be Monday. I will do a up to date Star Wars collection video so far with the new stuff I've gotten. The new stuff I'll be getting either today probably. So hope you enjoyed this video. Please rate, comment and subscribe and peace.